our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. All right, now for the introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Arnold Almighty Allen. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Islam Makachev. You ready? You ready? All right, so this highly anticipated stand-up only event is now underway. Friendly reminder on the rules that hopefully you play by them. No grappling of any type. So if you like striking, this is the event for you. Also, fighters cannot do follow-up strikes on the floor. This is a stand-up only event. Let's see how it plays out. Nice pop. Punch went nowhere. Oh, and he tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Allen. And just misses with that big right hand. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands going now. All right, so one minute into this fight and not much to dissect in terms of action. You may need to go use the restroom. You I might, mean, might be a good time. John, is it time? <laughs> Concession break. I'll be back with a hot dog. Oh, He's wobbling now. Allen circling towards the left side now. Big shot to the head. Oh, he lands another shot to the head. Under three minutes here to go in the round. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Islam Akasha. So he needs to mix it up. He needs to start kicking more. Continuing to go to the head. Unable to connect with the right. Head kick attempt, but the fighter got the right hand up. You know, that's, that's a big thing whenever you're blocking high kicks, man. You cannot just... Oh, oh he's hurt, he's hurt. Allen going for the leg kick. He does not connect. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye, and now there's a cut. But it's not... And you hear the crowd react every time they come in because they understand the power that these guys are striking with. Well, no denying that he walked him, but couldn't quite get the finish. He hurt him real bad, but he couldn't find the shot that would put him to sleep. He threw a lot of punches but he couldn't get the one to land on the button that would end the night. All right, so he lands another hook. He's already landed several in the round. That one might have been the most significant. That was the best one. But what I like about him throwing this punch over and over again, he just has a fantastic... Another one! Oh, he might be out. Final seconds here. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn, and now a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool, and he's only got 60 seconds to recover here, so we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Ready to fight. Ready. Here we are, early round two. Islam Akashev gets hit with that hook shot there. He's got to be careful to not allow the offense to follow up here. Well, informed speculation says he's going to try to set up another hook here. Makashev's now dealing with a cheek cut. Allen gets tattooed by that straight punch. Fighter lands a kick to the head now. Nice. 
just out of range with the straight left hand. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Oh! Well, he's looking for that left hand, just out of range, though, with it. Two minutes have gone by. Well, he. to go in and just get him out of there. Well, he's trying, but he gets a little bit anxious. So he starts to throw a lot of punches and not the right punches. And because he's throwing so much, he keeps missing. And by doing that, he's missing chances to end this fight. Makashev's limping. That would suggest that the leg kick is having the desired effects. Misses with the jab. We send it inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at four minutes, seven seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Arnold Almighty Allen. Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's sleeping tonight after what he was able to produce here. He's going to be smiling for a